Let's go. Take it easy. You've been here, you've been there. Slash right, slash left. Slash the new guard dogs to death. Grass one. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. What do you do here? Hunt Square Tell? You jest, right? Who cares about the Skyrtel anymore? Temer- Mentioned you have a problem. Mm-hmm. It's Vess. She took a couple of lads across the river. She plans to hit the Black Ones at Mulberdale. So? Sounds about like what guerrilla fighters do. Yes. When they're ordered to. Whereas I forbade her from leaving camp. Indefinitely. Why Mulberry Dale? Why'd Vesk go there? The peasants from the village aided us earlier. The Nilfgaardians learned of this. Word got out they're planning a punitive expedition. Probably hang every fifth villager. Hmm. Honestly, Vesk's desire to save the villagers makes sense. What doesn't is your opposition to the plan. War means death. Not only for the soldiers, for the common folk as well. You can't save them all, it's that simple. Funny. Had you for an idealist. You were right to. Are right to. But I have one ideal. A free Temeria. And I'm prepared to sacrifice anything for it. Don't trust Vess anymore? Bollocks. She's prepared to die for me. Ah, oh, that's not the problem. Know what distinguishes a soldier from a common swashbuckler? The uniform. It's a serious question. A rhetorical one. So instead of waiting for an answer, just enlighten me. Soldiers think tactically. They know when to strike, when to fall back, when to charge and when to hold. Vess finds this difficult. She's impulsive, hot-headed. Yet in guerrilla warfare, one false step and you're fucked. I confined her to the camp because I feared that sent out, she'd go rabid and make a mistake. I was right. All right, so you've got a problem. Insubordination. What am I supposed to do about it? I doubt Vess has entered the village. More likely she and the boys lie in wait in the woods nearby. We must find her before she attacks and stop her. You're a good tracker. Help me. Count me in. Thanks, Geralt. I'll owe you a favor. Meet me in Velen beneath the Hanged Man's Tree. It's just a short jaunt from there to Mulberrydale. Go, go. It's true you killed King. You and our commander, the Witcher. Slow now.
Get it like rain. Come on. Let's go!
Necker's circus here dig their way out. Come on, Roach. the village below. Black with Nilf guardians already. They're preparing to execute folk. No sign of Vess. Well, she may be impetuous, but she's not stupid. She's waiting for her moment. Probably attack after dusk once. Shh. What now? A trio, lightly equipped, sneaking closer. Over there, near the... Death to the Black Ones! Help me! Circa! Looks like we're too late. Follow me. Time's end. <laughs> Suicide mission, and instead of donning a breastplate, you dash into battle, shirt open, navel and whatnot exposed. You're not my father, Roach. You've no right to tell me what to wear. But I am your commander, and you will obey me. Guerrilla warfare. Warfare! It involves armies, for fuck's sake. I could not abandon them. They helped us. It's a soldier's job to kill, Bess, not save, not rescue. 
If that is not to your liking, join the sisters of Melitale. Study to be a healer. Fucking hell. Give me your weapon. You'll get it back when you wise up. If you wise up. Move out! <coughs> <coughs> Uh-oh. Got yourselves a prisoner. We don't take prisoners. You took my weapon, Roach. So I must manage with my bare hands. Leave him alone. There are corpses enough here. What? You heard me. I did, and I can't believe it. He came here to murder civilians. He's seen us. Will you have him return to his camp and report? Emir knows we can kill his men. Let him learn that we can also show mercy. Roach is right. Besides, killing a defenseless... What is it with you, Roach? Did the Witcher take your stones? They're sadists. He's the occupier. I will explain later. You, Nilfgaardian, piss off. Morentai. Nes dirmad ava. Go, before I change my mind. Ah, we should go before a patrol comes along. Thank you, Geralt. Ever need any help, you know where to find me. <laughs> 